So uh, here's the R4360 uh, 28 cylinder four row uh, radial engine that inspired my uh, stacker uh, engines. You can see here the the uh, that's the first row of cylinders, and uh, the second one is slightly staggered. You can see here they they go in a helix sort of. I called this engine the R4360 uh, corn cob, just because the unique um, way the cylinders were arranged to uh, get the cooling air. See, it, if you look there, it goes right back to the back in uh, cooling air passages. And of course, uh, here you can see the, the, they have the sheet metal ducting on. So from uh, from here over, all that goes to uh, the front cylinder. And then from there back, it's all ducted to the, the cylinders further back. The intake manifold running along here goes uh, back to the Supercharger in the back here. This all uh, probably uh, fuel injection or something there. Air and air and lets up top here. But as you can see, she's a she's a beast. See the uh, exhaust uh, openings here. Four of them, and well, they got one covered up there at the top. But uh, all exhaust is removed. Well, this is uh, intake uh, piping here, so there'd be seven of them since there's. Uh, Four times uh, seven, 28 cylinders. She's she's a real monstrosity, that's for sure. And also along that, there's this uh, two V12s bolted together here, uh, Allison 3420. Yeah, you got uh, regular V12 there, and another V12 over on the other side, and they, they bolted them together, to form this. Uh, Big monstrosity liquid cooled engine. So, uh, here at the uh, Glenn Curtis Museum in uh, Hammondsport, New York, we've got uh, quite a few uh, interesting uh, radial engines. Here's an R2800 14 cylinder uh, radial double wasp. Um, yeah, really interesting one over here. So, yeah, they got some four cylinders and upside down straight six here. But here's a uh, eight cylinder radio made by, it says Ford AE 1947. So it's two cylinders deep. And it's showing better on this one. That's the intake manifold running up from the back there. So an exhaust stump down on that one. But uh, two cylinders deep and uh, right in a row there. So she makes a, an X shape. I've never seen an engine like that. Rather uh, unique. But uh, if you're ever in the area, stop by and uh, pay this museum a visit. It's, uh, it's really good in uh, Hammondsport, uh, New York. Lots of stuff to see here. Let's do a quick uh, show around here. You got to have an hour or two to walk through this for sure. There's uh, all kinds of stuff here. Cars and planes and boats and just all kinds of stuff. 7 8 scale uh, P40 Warhawk. Eh? Racing planes. And, uh, yeah, I like some of these old uh, boats here. That one's got a the big one there. It's got a V12 in it. And uh, this little guy here. But just all kinds of stuff to see here.